Hi, everyone. My name is Christian. Hi, everyone. My name is Adrian. Hi, Adrian. Adrian, how are you today? Hi, Christian. Thank you. I'm very well. How are you? Um, I'm fine, too. Um, I'm a little bit uh, tired um, right now. Uh, here, right now, uh, the time is 2.30 p.m. So right now, it's about 2.30 p.m. Okay. okay. Or you could say, um, how would you say this? I would say 1,400 hours. Oh, yeah. Whoops. I mean, not 1,400, but how would you say this? I would say 1,430 hours. Yeah, so it's 2.30 p.m. or 1,430 hours. So it's the afternoon right now. It's 2.30 in the afternoon here. And at this time in the afternoon, I usually feel a little bit uh, tired. So I have my coffee here. This is my coffee. And I have my water here to drink. And yeah, so I'm a little bit tired. I'm a little bit uh, tired, but I'm OK. Good. Um, Adrian, I, I was trying to remember. Um, what is your favorite color? Is it this color, Adrian? Is it orange? Is that your favorite color? Yes, Christian. Orange is my favorite, my absolute favorite color. Oh, good. So I remembered correctly. So I remembered. Yeah, or <laughs> it, orange. Orange is your favorite color. And uh, right now, I see that you are wearing an orange shirt. That's right. I'm wearing my orange polo shirt. So uh, th this polo shirt is orange. And orange is my favorite color. And this is my favorite polo shirt. Right, yes, I remember before. Uh, you showed me that shirt, and that is your favorite shirt. That polo shirt is, it's mostly orange, and it has a little bit of purple too, right? Just a little bit, a little bit of purple here and here. Uh, um, Adrian, do you like the color purple as well? I find purple, the color purple is okay on its own, on its own, it's okay. But together with orange as a combination, I really like it. Yeah, I, I like that too. I think orange and purple, uh, they go together well. Those, these two colors go together well. Mm. Um, so yeah, so I see you are wearing your favorite polo shirt, your favorite shirt, and it's orange and purple. And, oh, Adrian, do you uh, remember what my favorite color is? Yes, Christian, I do remember. Now I do remember your favorite color, I think, is actually blue. Blue, yes. Yes, my favorite color is blue. Um, so here is dark blue, here is light blue. Um, I like both of these colors, but I think my favorite, my favorite shade of blue is dark blue like this. Mm, mm. Um, so I like blue. My favorite color is blue. Uh, so blue is my favorite color, but I don't wear blue that often. I don't wear many blue clothes. Uh, do you know, Adrian, do you know what, what color of clothes do I like to wear? Well, I can see that you're wearing black clothes now. And I've seen you wear black clothes in the past several times. So in the past, you've worn black clothes again 
And again, so I think that you like to wear black clothes. Am yes. I right? Yes, I like to wear black clothes. Um, so especially shirts, especially shirts that are black. So this shirt is black. Uh, this t-shirt is black. And I have many black clothes. Uh, here's another t-shirt, mm -hmm. another black t-shirt. So there's a black t-shirt and I have, here's a black pair of, of pants, of sweatpants. So I have many black clothes. And Adrian, do you, do you know what my favorite item of clothing is? My favorite thing to wear? Well, first I'll guess that it's black and you look very comfortable in what you're wearing now. I'm guessing your favorite clothes are that black hoodie. Yes, yes, you are right. Um, I think, I think before I told you, right? I think so. <laughs> yeah. So right now I am wearing my favorite shirt, my favorite item of clothing, this shirt, this shirt is my favorite shirt and it is black and I like to wear uh, especially shirts uh, that are black. So I like to wear, I like to wear things that are black and this shirt, this hoodie, it has a hood here. I can put mm -hmm. the hood up. This is a hooded sweatshirt or hoodie and this hooded sweatshirt, this hoodie, is my favorite shirt. It, it looks good on you. It looks really good on you. Oh, thank you, Adrian. Yeah, I, I think so too. I think that this shirt looks good on me. Christian, when you put it on, or when you put it on, mm -hmm. how, do you, how do you feel? Mm, when I put it on, I feel comfortable. It feels comfortable, um, kind of, kind of relaxing to wear. It, so it feels comfortable on me. You look very comfortable. Yeah, I think I think so too. I think that I look comfortable in it, and also I feel I feel comfortable wearing this hooded sweatshirt or. Uh, so this is a hooded sweatshirt, and for short, people call it a hoodie. So this is a hoodie or hooded sweatshirt. So your sweatshirt has a, a hood on it, so it's yeah. called a hoodie. Mm -hmm. What else does your sweatshirt have? What other things? Yeah, what else does this hooded sweatshirt have? So of course, it's a hooded sweatshirt. So of course, being a hooded sweatshirt, it must have, it must have a hood. So I can wear it like this. Usually I wear it like this. Usually I don't put the hood up. So sometimes, um, oh, if it's cold, if it's cold, or if it's, if it's windy outside, um, then I will put the hood up. So when it's cold, I can put the hood up. Um, but also, oh, here's another thing it has. It has these. These are mm -hmm. the drawstrings. So these are drawstrings. And if I pull the drawstrings, what, what, do, <laughs> Adrian, what do you think will happen when I pull the drawstrings? I, I, think, pull them? I think that when you pull the drawstrings, the hood, will get smaller and tighter around your head. Yeah, so when I pull the drawstrings, let, let me pull them, let's pull them and find out. So I'm pulling them. Uh, <laughs> it looks like my head is getting smaller, but <laughs> it's... Now, <laughs> now you look like an Arctic explorer like you're going to go away somewhere where it is cold or windy 
yeah, someone, yeah, someone who goes somewhere, somewhere that's very cold and very, very windy, uh, will have to wear a hood like this and have the hood pulled very tight to mm. cover all of their head, to cover their ears, cover their ears, cover both ears, and also cover cover their neck. So mm. this will cover. Let me pull the zipper up. There, it covers my neck now, and it also. Oh, it can also, let me pull it tighter. It can even cover most of my face. Wow. <laughs> so now it can even cover, oh, it can cover my eyes almost and can cover, it can cover my cheeks. There's my cheeks. So it can mm -hmm. cover, can cover my cheeks and it can cover, almost cover my mouth even. Nearly. So it covers most of my face, but still, oh, <laughs> can you see my eyes? I can see your eyes. Yeah. I can see your <laughs> nose, your mouth, your teeth, your cheeks, but I can't see your ears mm -hmm. or your hair. Yeah. So you can still, Adrian, you can still see my eyes. You can still see my nose. You can still see my. Uh, lips and if I smile <laughs> you can see my teeth yeah and but uh, oh you can see my cheeks too there but uh, you can't see my ears None. and you can't see my my hair there's my hair there's a bit <laughs> there's a little bit of hair some of my hair yeah so if if I pull this if I pull the drawstrings mm -hmm. I can pull it and cover up uh, much of my head. I can cover up my head. So here's my head, and I've covered up most of my head. I've covered up most of my head. I've covered up my head except for this part of my face. So, except I've covered up my head and most of my face, except for my eyes, except for my nose, and except for my mouth, and except for some of my cheeks here. <laughs> so, and I can see one eyebrow. I can see an eyebrow just about. Oh, yes. Yeah, there's an eyebrow, one eyebrow. Eyebrow. Um, there's some hair. Yeah. So, yeah. So if, if it is cold and if it's very cold ugh, and maybe if it's very windy, so outside, if it's cold and windy, windy outside, I can pull the drawstrings and cover up my head and cover up part of my face and cover up with the zipper there, pull up, if mm -hmm. I pull up the zipper, I can cover up my neck. So now, but in here, in here, it's kind of, it's too hot for that. So I hot. will pull, I can pull this part, mm -hmm. pull the hood out and I, I will take, um, what would you say when I do this? What am yeah. I doing here? I would say um, I'm taking my hood off and now you're doing your hair. That's called. Yeah, it's messed up my hair, hair. So I have to rearrange my hair there, there, my hair. And did you pull the zipper down a little bit to make your collar looser? So the zipper came down just a little mm. bit to open up your collar. Right. So here is the zipper and I can uh, unzip it so I can pull down the zipper here and I can pull up the zipper. And if I pull up, usually I have the zipper here, up to here. So mm -hmm. usually I don't have it unzipped like that. I have the zipper up to here. Um, so I have the zipper up to here, uh -huh. but then when I pull it up further, if I pull it all the way up, if I pull it up, way. if I zip it up oh. all the way up, it goes up to here. Mm -hmm. So it, it covers my neck. This covers my neck when the zipper that, is pulled up. That looks that looks a little bit tight. Yeah, it's yeah. Like Christian. Yeah, it feels it feels a little bit tight uh, on my neck, or it feels like it's pushing on my neck. So that's mm -hmm. that's mm -hmm. like when it's like this. When the zipper is all the way up like this, that's a little bit uncomfortable. 
it feels a little bit uncomfortable. It feels kind of tight or like it's pushing on my neck. So that's, it's a little bit uncomfortable like this. So this, this is more comfortable like that. That's Good. more comfortable, more relaxed feeling, <laughs> more comfortable. So when you have your hood down and when you have the zipper down a little bit, so not all the way up to the top, but a little bit lower, so the zipper is lower, you feel more relaxed and you feel more comfortable. Yeah, this, when it's like this, when the hood is down like this, and when the zipper is a little bit down, um, it feels more comfortable. When it's, when it's not too cold, if, if it's very cold, then this way would be more comfortable, having the hood up and the zipper up. This would be more comfortable when it is cold, but if it's not cold, like here, inside, inside this house, it is not very cold. So this is uncomfortable. It feels too hot like this. Mm -hmm. That's uncomfortable. It's not comfortable like this. So I'll pull, I'll take the, the hood down or first unzip the zipper a little bit and take the hood off or take the hood down. Mm -hmm. And this, now my hair is messed up again. Let me fix my hair. <laughs> so this, this is more comfortable. This, this is comfortable now inside the house mm -hmm. it's more comfortable like this and there's another thing that i've seen i can see your arms i can see this part of your arms your forearms i can see your forms does this mean that you've rolled up the sleeves yeah, so these are the sleeves and they are long sleeves. They, they, these are not short sleeves mm -hmm. like a, uh, like a t-shirt. Of course, a t-shirt like this. This is a t-shirt. Uh, this t-shirt, uh, this is an old t-shirt. This t-shirt has very short sleeves. Okay. And these are the sleeves. The sleeves are very, very short, but this does not have uh, short sleeves like that. It has long sleeves. Mm -hmm. So this, this hooded sweatshirt has long sleeves, but uh, usually when I wear this, when I wear this, I pull up the sleeves. Uh, I, don't, I don't roll them up. Roll them up would be like this if I rolled okay. it up. So that would be rolling it up. I'm rolling it up here and then I'll unroll it. So I, I don't roll up the sleeves like that. Mm -hmm. Usually I just pull them up. So I pull up the mm -hmm. sleeves. So they still cover up uh, this part of my arms, but you can see my forearms, this mm. part of my arms. Um, so yeah, so actually the reason I do that um, is this shirt, unfortunately, um, the, the cuffs, these are the cuffs, right? The cuffs, mm -hmm. yeah, the cuffs are not tight. They're not tight like this, so okay. that would be tight but they're not tight, look. They're loose. Yeah, so they're, they're loose. They're not tight, they're loose. Yeah, the cuffs are loose, the cuffs are loose. And mm. when the cuffs are loose like that, it's kind of, that's kind of uncomfortable. It's not comfortable like that. So when the, it's like this here, it's more, it's more tight here. So here it's tight, mm -hmm. but here around my wrists, it's not tight. It's not tight around my wrists. So it, that's, it's more comfortable when it's, when it's tight here. That's interesting. That's interesting for me to learn from you, Christian, because if this is your favorite sweatshirt, so this is your favorite sweatshirt, it's not perfect it isn't perfect but you have a special way to wear your favorite sweatshirt yeah i've i've gotten used to this i've gotten accustomed to it or i've gotten used to wearing it like this i've gotten used to wearing this shirt so i'm used to wearing it and i'm also used to wearing it this way so i'm used to pulling the sleeves up like this i'm used to 
having the zipper here and not down here, not up here, but here. I'm used to usually having the hood down unless, unless it's cold, then I'll put the hood up like this. Otherwise, I'll keep the hood down. So I'm used to wearing it a certain way. I'm used to wearing it this way. Mm -hmm. Christian, have you had this sweatshirt for a long time? I have not had this shirt for a long time. So I, I have not owned this shirt or had this shirt for a long time. Okay. okay. But it, this shirt is not very new. It's not very new. It's uh, pretty old. It's old. Do you know how old it is? Mm, actually, I'm not sure, but uh, let me tell you this shirt, this shirt uh, originally at first, it was not my shirt. It was one of my brother's uh, shirts. So here, let me draw a picture. <laughs> this, <laughs> this is me. Oh, let me add some hair. <laughs> this is me. Um, here is there is my mother, mm -hmm. and here is my father. So there is me, and here is my mother and father, my mom and dad, and then I have. Oh, do you know how many? brothers I have? I don't know how many brothers or sisters you have, Christian. You've mentioned one brother. Yeah, I have two brothers. I have two younger brothers. Mm -hmm. So this, this shirt comes from one of my brothers. Uh, this is my youngest brother. So I, I am the oldest. And this is my younger brother. This mm -hmm. is my youngest brother. And it comes from my younger brother, not, uh, not my youngest brother, but him, my younger brother. So this shirt is from him. And oh, I, I asked my brother, I, I asked him, how old is this shirt? How old is it? And <laughs> he said, um, I, I don't think, I don't think he was sure. I think he said that this shirt was 10 or 15, 10 or 15 years old. Okay. So maybe from around, hmm. so this year is 2022. This shirt might be uh, 10 years old or 15 years old, this shirt. So maybe this shirt is from, around around this time <laughs> around around 2010 around okay this year so that's that's very old that's uh 10 or 15 years old maybe maybe it's from 2010 or longer ago so maybe it's older than 2010 maybe it's older than 10 years old maybe maybe it's even 15 years old mm -hmm. So according to my brother, uh, it's, it's a very old shirt. <laughs> it, it still looks good. Yeah, it looks, it looks good, but yeah, it's probably, that's probably the reason it's kind of loose like this, because if it's that old, 10 or 15 years mm -hmm. old, or from around, around 2010, then it's not, it's not new. So it's still okay to wear, it's still comfortable, but it's not, it's not new. And it's not in um, the same as when it was new, I think. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I, I, I think that being comfortable in clothes is very important. Um, then if clothes look good too, that's a bonus. It makes it better, but I've got to be comfortable. Yeah, yeah, I, I like to be comfortable. 
Um, but also it can be nice to go and shop and look for new clothes. Um, but new clothes can be comfortable too. But I don't, I don't really, I don't really like to go out and shop for clothes very often. So if if I find something, if I look and I find something comfortable, then I like to wear it a lot. I like mm -hmm. to wear it uh, maybe every day even. I'm the same. I'm the same. I could wear the same clothes again and again and again every day. I could. Yeah, so this this shirt, um, for example, let me draw a week here. So here's here's one week. One week mm -hmm. has how many days in a week? There's one day, two day, three days, four days, five days, six days, seven days. So That's there's right. a week. Um, Sunday, oh, today is Sunday. Here's Monday, uh, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, and Saturday. So there's one week. Mm -hmm. uh, today is Sunday. Uh, Sunday, here's, so today is Sunday. And then here's Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. So one week has how many days? One week has seven days. Yes, yes, one week has seven days. So this is one week. And in one week, in a typical week, in an average week, mm, I think I, I wear this a lot. Um, I wear this, I think, <laughs> maybe even most days, most days. So maybe uh, today, Sunday, I wear this, then maybe tomorrow, I will wear it too, on Monday. Um, then maybe I will wear it again on Tuesday. Maybe I won't wear it on Wednesday, mm -hmm. um, but maybe I'll wear it again on Thursday. And then maybe I won't wear it on Friday, but then maybe I will wear it again on Saturday. But unless, unless it gets warmer, unless it gets hot here, if it gets hotter, if the weather mm -hmm. is hot, if it's very sunny, if it's very, here's the sun, <laughs> here's the sun, if it's very sunny and it gets hot here, then I won't wear it as much. But if it's, if it's colder, maybe if it's some clouds, if it's cloudy, or if it's a little bit colder, if it's a little bit colder outside, then, then I will wear it many days. I will still wear it a lot. Or maybe um, on a day when it is hot and sunny, when it's hot and sunny, then in the evening, so later through the day, the temperature might come down. It might be less or not so hot, the temperature comes down and you might think, hmm, now I want to wear my sweatshirt again because it's colder and I need to put something on because it's later in the day. Right, so later in the day. So maybe uh, on Wednesday, maybe I won't wear this on Wednesday during the day. So in the daytime, so here's the sun in the daytime. The sun rises in the morning. So in the morning, the sun rises and then it's the daytime. So right now here, it's the daytime. Um, it's the afternoon here. Um, so the sun is starting, the sun is still up here, but then, then when the sun starts to go down, mm -hmm. so there's the sun starts to go down in the evening. Um, here in the middle of the day or in the afternoon, it's hotter, but then as the sun, as the sun goes down, it gets uh, cooler or even cold. Might so be cold. maybe on Wednesday, yeah, <laughs> maybe on Wednesday, I won't wear this, but then during the day, during this time, I won't wear this. But then when the sun starts to go down, then I will put this on and maybe even wear the hood, maybe even <laughs> wear it with the hood if it is cold. But not now. <laughs> take, 
I'll take the hood off. Sometimes that happens to me. So in the morning, when the sun is coming up and it's a little bit cold, I sometimes wear a sweatshirt. The sun goes up into the sky and it's hot. I take my sweatshirt off and I put it somewhere. And then the sun goes down and I think, where is my sweatshirt? Where did I put it? And I have to look for it and I don't know where it is. Oh, you, you misplaced your, your sweatshirt like this or a, a sweatshirt you have? Yes, sometimes. Yeah. Is, it, uh, is your shirt a hooded sweatshirt with a hood like this or does oh. it not have a hood? I have one hooded sweatshirt, a hoodie. Um, and I think yesterday, so yesterday, which was Saturday, yesterday, I'd taken it off, put it down, and then I thought, where is it? And it was, oh. and it was two meters away. It was only over there, two meters away. So it wasn't far. It was right there, very close, but I didn't see it because I was looking very hard. Oh, I see. So you you misplaced it. You put it there, but then you, you, you forgot, right? And then you were looking all over. You were looking everywhere. You were looking around everywhere for it. So you were looking and, but all along it was right there, right? It was right, just there. right, right beside you, right? Very close to where you were, right? That's it. It was only <laughs> over there and I'd gone up the stairs. I'd gone into all the rooms. I'd gone into the bedroom and I'd gone into the other room. I couldn't see it. And I had to come back down and go slowly. I looked slowly and carefully. And then I saw it. <laughs> that's, <laughs> that's good that you finally, you finally looked and found it though. So Christian, we've been looking at your favorite sweatshirt and it's special because it has a hood. So it's a hooded sweatshirt. We can call it a hoodie. I can also see it has a zip. Yeah, it has a zipper. And that goes up and down. It goes yeah. up and down so that you can be comfortable and feel relaxed. It has drawstrings so that you can adjust the hood, make it tight. Mm -hmm. Can make it tight like make that. Tight. Yeah. And then we can only see part of your face. So your eyes, your nose and your mouth. Yeah, I, <laughs> I can make it very tight. And with a zipper like that, the zipper cover up, up most of my head, cover up most of my face. Or and... you can relax the drawstrings, let them out and have your hood looser again yeah i can down. pull it looser like that there it's looser now so i can loosen it like this now it's looser is there anything else that you can tell us about your sweatshirt yeah well i'll take the uh the hood off here bring the hood down um what else does this have so yeah so this has the hood of course it has the hood and it has the drawstrings here to, to tighten, or um, I can loosen, I can pull the hood so I can tighten it like this. I can pull the drawstrings to tighten it. Then I can pull the hood like this to loosen it. And then it has the zipper, like you said, I can zip it up. I can zip the zipper up or unzip it. Um, and it also has uh, these, it has, or this, this. So this is a pocket, it has a pocket and it has, the pocket has two openings. It has one opening here, so uh -huh. I can put one hand in here and it has this opening too. So I can put my other, my other hand, I can put my other hand in this opening. Mm. So this is the pocket. So on the front here, on the front, there's a big pocket here. So if it's cold and maybe your hands are cold, you can put them inside 
the pocket and keep them nice and warm. Yeah, sometimes I do that. If it's a little bit cold, um, then maybe I'm outside and I'm walking outside. Uh, if, I'm, if I'm walking and it's a little bit cold, then so that my hands are not, are not cold, um, to keep my hands warm, I can put my hands in the pocket like this. So my hands will be okay. So my hands will be uh, not too cold. So my hands will stay warm. I'll put them in the pocket like this. And oh, also here's another feature. So the pocket is one of the features. Mm -hmm. uh, the zipper is another feature of this hoodie. Um, of course, it's a hoodie, so it must have a hood and it has the drawstrings. That's another feature. Uh, here's one more feature uh, in the cuffs here. Remember, the cuffs are kind of loose here. Oh, yes. But actually, the, the cuffs do have something. Actually, oh, maybe, oh, now that I think of this, maybe, maybe this is why the cuffs are loose like this. Look at this, this hole in it. Okay. This hole? So oh, there's yeah. a hole in the cuff here. There's a hole in this cuff. There's there's a hole here. I can put mm -hmm. I can put a finger. I can put my finger through the hole. Nice. So there's there's a hole in both cuffs. Both cuffs have a hole in them. Okay. And what oh, what do you think that's for? Oh. Why why do these have holes? Hmm. I'm I'm not sure. I don't really know. If I'm honest. Yeah, I, I think the reason is um, I can pull I can pull the sleeve and then pull it pull it over my hand and then yeah. put my thumb I can oh. put my thumb through the hole like that and same with this I can put my thumb through this hole in the cuff so I can wear it like this um, so that kind of, that covers part of my hand. Um, so maybe that sometimes, sometimes when it's a little bit cold, I'll also mm -hmm. wear it like this. Okay. And that's, um, again, it's a little bit warmer or it can feel a little bit more comfortable when, when it is cold. Um, does, does it feel tight? Does the sleeve feel tight now mm -hmm. that you put your thumbs through the holes? Is that tight? Or yeah, it's it's still loose. So maybe it's loose. loose because because it is old. Maybe it's still loose. But actually, this part this part is tight. Okay. So I'm not sure. I think maybe maybe that's the reason for this. Hmm. But I, I don't know. I'm not sure. I'm not sure if that's what this is for. But sometimes sometimes if it's a little bit cold, hmm. and I'm outside, I'm walking outside, I will wear it like this. But now that you're inside you mm -hmm. usually so yeah you i usually pull, pull up the, the sleeves, sleeves up and yeah you didn't, i usually pull didn't, the sleeves up you didn't roll them rolling them is different you pulled them up yeah right? yeah so i don't i don't roll them up this would so be rolling, rolling like this up. yeah rolling is that so i don't do that i don't i don't do this i don't roll the sleeves up so i don't do this I do, I do this, I, I pull the sleeves up. I pull the sleeves up like this. And now, now it's tight here. The cuffs are pretty tight and it's comfortable like this. So this, again, this shirt is comfortable. I like this shirt. Um, I think of course, because I like wearing clothes that are black and also because this hooded shirt this shirt is comfortable. 